Okay, the jugular vein, the subclavian artery, and the subclavian vein, the superior vena cava. Okay. The common carotid artery. The aortic arch. The thoracic descending aorta. The axillary artery. And the axillary vein. the brachial artery and then the brachial vein mm -mm. the left subclavian artery the basilic vein the basilic vein is that really really long one the ulnar artery And then the radial artery, 32 right there. The cephalic vein. The diaphragm. The hepatic vein. The common hepatic artery. The celiac trunk. And it has three branches, which are 61, which is the hepatic artery, 66, which is the splenic artery, hepatic portal vein, 62 right there. Okay. Inferior vena cava, which is kind of behind there. The renal artery. Oh. And then the renal vein. Okay. The superior mes mesenteric. <laughs> mesenteric. Mesenteric. Artery. Okay, then the splenic artery, which is up there, number 66. The abdominal descending aorta. What's that? Descending aorta. So once it passes the diaphragm, it's? It's the whole trunk, like this whole thing. Okay. Um, the inferior mesenteric artery okay okay the common iliac artery and then the common iliac vein the external iliac artery external iliac vein the internal iliac artery the internal iliac vein <coughs> Okay, the femoral artery, and it becomes the femoral artery once it passes the inguinal ligament. Then the femoral vein, the popliteal artery, by the knee, the posterior tibial artery, And then the anterior tibial artery.